Hello everybody, this is Scott Stewart, Slabtown Customs out of Mountain View, Arkansas. And today's tour is just going to be a, a kind of a quick one. This is one of our recent builds. Um, this is a little 8x16. This is just a dried in unit or what some people would call a shell. Um, customers are going to finish this house out uh, on their own as far as interior goes. Uh, we are road legal. We're 8 wide and we're actually right at 20 foot long. I'll show you that extra length on the back. And we're at 13 foot 6 inches roughly tall uh, so like i said road legal got our lap siding <coughs> uh, on the exterior we got a, a burnished light brown metal roof we've got several windows in this house so anyway we'll go around here and show you shot inside and yes that's mud that is scattered along the front we just done a little test run and, and weighed this house and we haven't had rain here in months and we got quite a bit last night so what you see splattered on the front of that house was uh, about four inches of dust on my yard yesterday. Anyway, you can see uh, we do have a loft in the end of this house, sleeping loft. We've got a window up top for it. We've got a window there in the front that you see that's going to be one of the kitchen windows. Another window there that's also a kitchen window. We've got a set of uh, five foot French doors, outswing French doors on this house. Again, this is just a dried in unit. We did do the, had the roughed in electrical. And plumbing done. We're on 30 amp, 110 volt RV service. RV cord running out to power it up. This is going to be the bathroom. As the layout requested by the buyer, you can see we'll have a toilet in this end, sink under the window, and a three to three shower stall. And then the kitchen will kind of be in an L shape, starting there and then running back this way. <clears throat> Again, we've got an eight by eight loft. And as typical for us, we've got a nine foot tall sidewall plus a six inch header running full length, both sidewalls. So we've got a little over two feet of sidewall in the loft before the roof pitch. So there's quite a bit of room in that loft. Uh, of course, then about half the house is living space. You're losing about half to the kitchen and bathroom, the other half, of course, living space. Uh, again, French doors, both doors do operate on this. Let's a lot of light, a lot of space in. And then on the back, we have just got a little bit of deck space. Could basically be storage. Um, some people are gonna say that's wasted and that should have been included as house space, but this house was ordered as an eight by 16. And we just happened to use a frame that was about a 20 footer. And instead of cutting it off, we decided to go ahead and give them a little bonus and surprise deck area and uh, they seem to be quite happy about that and something about motorcycle dirt bike storage was mentioned for that area but anyway uh, if you have any questions about this house any of our other previous builds as well as the custom build as always you can contact me anytime text or call me at 870-213-5310 or uh, shoot me an email at ozarksbest at yahoo.com thanks for watching guys we appreciate it